This is Mutaraja. It is also called Saksharan. He was brought to Sri Lanka from Thailand in 2001 as a gift. Now 30 years old. It is preparing for a rare flight of five hours today. Mutaraja's story is not so lucky. Let's watch how its air mission is. Mutaraja is the elephant with the longest tusks in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka received it as a donation from the Thai government in 2001. This elephant, known as Saksharan in Thailand, is named Mutaraja in Sri Lanka. As soon as this Mutaraja arrived in Sri Lanka it was entrusted to the temple called Kandi Viharaya. Mutaraja is an animal belonging to the highest class of elephants. So it was used in the Parahara of Sri Lanka. But suddenly, Mutaraja falls ill. Allegations are being made against the Kandi Viharaya and the elephant keeper. As a result, Mutaraja brought to Dehawala Zoo. This is it abode. Elephant Arena. This is a day in the second week of November 2022. It has been a few days since Mutaraja came to Dehawala Zoo. It has a unique voice that an elephant does not have. During the seven months in zoo, it was continuously screaming. Two years ago, Mutaraja had a leg problem. The elephant keepers say that it was coosed by a blow with a bug hammer. The elephant had two big wounds on its back. The elephant keepers say that it is elephant hook attacks. Later, a female veterinarian from Dehawala Zoo treated the injuries. A lorry driver who was not an elephant keeper was given to take care of Mutaraja at the temple. He is the one who brutally attacked the elephant. Later this secret was revealed by environmental organizations in Sri Lanka and informed to the Thai government. A team of veterinarians from Thailand examined the elephant and said that it should be taken back to Thailand. During that time, Matharaja was in Dahawala Zoo for seven months. Mutaraja weighs 3.5 tons. Still 30 years old, it has the potential to have the longest tusks in Asia. Despite its young age, Matharaja has also lost the right to breed. 
The elephant is used in the temple only as a means of earning income. The veterinary team from Thailand advised to prepare a large cage to take the elephant back. This cage weighs 5 tons. A special plane is required to transport the 3.5-ton Matharaja to Thailand. The 47 meters long Ilyashing Il-76, made in Russia, is perfect for that. This plane can carry a load of 75 tons. 15 people including the staff, elephant keepers and veterinarians travel here. During this five-hour journey, 250 kilograms of food is also taken to quench Matharaja's hunger. The Thai authorities say that this is the first time that an elephant has been airlifted to their country. It is the same for Sri Lanka. The total cost of this project is estimated to be 25 crore rupees. <laughs> 